Hello and welcome to What Are You Saying? Hashtag Ways, where we talk about topics in the news as it affects us all. I am Osayuwa Besale and today I'm joined by Faith, Ola Sainde and Sandra Eze. Hello. Hello. Hi. Sandra is the only one complaining to Valentine. Like... And the fact is I'm the only one who is bullish. <laughs> no, we are all, okay, except for you, we're all single. <laughs> so how do you know we're in red? Because it's like There's red standard. in our hair, is it not? And, oh, and lipstick, on. so it's, it's red <laughs> enough. So I decided to just be in the Valentine spirit and just feel like, like, like them did <laughs> <laughs> That's nice. So why are you bullish now, Auntie, with all this package that you have? It's, I think Should I start I, looking for a boo for you? It's honestly, difficult to please you, sure you know. I do have standards yeah. and I'm not apologetic for those standards because I work hard on my, I'm very disciplined and hard on myself to bring as much value as I expect from whoever Mr. Boo is. So I'm not, um, uh, I'm not going to back down on my standards. I'm, I'll keep upgrading it and whoever it is has to meet up that standard. I'm like, that I'm makes not sense. apologetic right, so about it. On that note, <laughs> here's what we found as today's quote. <laughs> At the end of the day, you can either focus on what's tearing you apart or what's keeping you together. That's a quote, um, it's an anonymous uh, person that said this um, quote. What do you ladies think? Because today we're talking about conflict resolution in relationship and we have experts to tell us yeah. a lot yeah. about this. You know, I actually agree with this. There is this couple um, I follow on Instagram, Tom and Lynn. I can't remember their surname. And so they would, they, they would say during an interview I watched on, I think on jo, jo, Jay Shetty's uh, Instagram page, he's, they said that one of the things that makes them stronger is the fact that they don't even acknowledge their weaknesses. They just focus straight forward on those strengths. And the more you focus on those strengths, the it, more the person wants to weakens, exactly, the, the live up to that standard and the, the weaknesses just start dwindling slowly. away. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's so true. So yeah. staying positive, focusing yeah. on what focus is working. On what works yeah. rather than, oh my gosh, you're such a terrible mm, person. Those are yeah. Because annoying. the truth is that, you know, there's something interesting about the universe, right? Yeah. If you are looking for Look at this room now. If you're looking for anything green, all of a mm -hmm. sudden your focus is now. Green, you're now beginning right. to see that we have so much green. Actually, yeah. I, yeah. I know so <laughs> you know, green this, everywhere. You know? So, but so that's the thing. If I if I change the color to red, you begin to see red. red. If I change, so that's the the principle of of um, of life. When you focus on something, mm -hmm. yeah. so attractive. if you focus on what's what's wrong, what's not happening, what's what's making you angry, you keep getting angry. Sure. You know? So. Sure. It's always good to stay positive. Yep. All right, so today we're talking handling conflicts and relationship. But first, we'll see what we found in the news after the break. Please stay with us. <laughs> 